Hey everybody, I'm Recycled, and welcome back to Let's Play Fallout 2. I always scroll up at the beginning of the uh, episode because of the way I do everything. Anyway, um, that's not really important. Oh yeah, um, it occurred to me while I was thinking about things recently that we have like uh, a lot of money, and um, the guns that we want actually aren't worth very much for some reason, despite the fact that they fucking kick ass. Um... Uh, but you know what? Since we're in, uh, oh yeah, and also, my unarmed skill is like, uh, and I need one more percent to do something better. Um, so I should probably go gain another level. Also, uh, level twenty-four is when we're gonna really wreck shop. Level twenty-one, not so much. But wrecking shop will become much more simple for us if we can get a hold of these guns. And since we're here. You know, open this door. Then, uh, why not? And this guy sells guns, I think. Um, bitch, you know what I want. Okay, he's got money too, just in case. Actually, yeah, we should probably trade some stuff. But let's just make sure that he has what we want. You got all kinds of good stuff. Look at that. Book of Science and shit. Xander root. Brock flower. Oh, fuck. How much are these worth? Oh. That's totally attainable. And I still can't understand why stim packs are worth so fucking much. That's crazy. Oh, he doesn't have them. This is... Oh, wait. Maybe I have to talk to him. I'm looking for equipment. Uh, nope. That's the same stuff you just showed me. Okay. He's not the guy I want to talk to. Although, he is a guy you should talk to. I can't believe he had all those mentats. If I had known that, we might have, uh, not had to run around quite as much. Um, this guy. Who is in this building again? This is, uh... Oh no, you can't do it that way. What, if you walk... Actually, isn't that really cool? If you walk where there's a window, then you can see inside. There's not going to be a window there. Okay, fuck, I'm just going to go in. This guy is a, a really smart doctor. But we're not really smart doctors. I probably shouldn't have put my points into gambling. That was probably really dumb. I probably should have put it into Doctor, because we can get some extra upgrades that way. And those are good move. Those are really good. Let's go talk to that guy. Yes, this guy obviously sells guns. Welcome to Red Triple Eight. I'm my the Chang, the owner. How can I help you? I think you had a different voice before. I'm looking for rep re weaponry. <laughs> a weapon, eh? Oh, this is what I have. Sorry. <laughs> uh, I'm trying to learn Chinese because um, I play Grand Theft Auto Online, and for some reason, it absolutely does not care where you're from at all. Oh, look. Uh, I think we need one of these. And, oh, that's too bad. He only has that. <coughs> I was hoping he would have that and, like, the big version of that. But how mo Oh, God. I'll be right back. Um, what's our barter skill? Not fucking good. Man. Hey, everyone, get in my way so I can't go where I want to. Uh. <sighs> the thing is, I was on uh, the wiki and I was looking at the price of everything and we're never going to use that. Never, ever. Um, 
I think we can carry everything we need to. Uh, do I have my guns equipped? Just out of curiosity. Yeah. Because, um, yeah, because these are good to trade. Uh, light support weapon, I believe. I think it's a big gun. I think it's a really big gun. And I realize if we had Marcus in our party, I think he specializes in big guns. We could give him the Bozar, which is fucking crazy. But honestly, I think the Bozar is totally OP. And I just don't like even using it. It's crazy. Also, we forgot to stop at Redding. Maybe we should just go do the... No, we should... Well, first let's get the gun. I'm going to just grab that now. We don't need these. Um, that's such a cool, unique thing. I'm not trading it. Uh, those aren't worth money. I don't need those anymore. We don't need these. Vic's got the other thing. Vic's got an assault rifle, just like those. I hate these loud guns. I hate these loud guns. Uh, why doesn't Sue, like, actually can't where is suit so, uh, th this thing is not helping me oh there he is hey guy why don't your foot your ankle rather carry um, as much stuff as you can he's got three suits of armor that we're not using that must he must have the brotherhood armor then unless I'm stupid and did something wrong but I probably now I'm doubting it so now I have to check uh, okay, but what about, like, one? Okay, how about two? How about three? He can only carry two. <coughs> Close enough. I've got vertebrate plans in my inventory. Let's grab even more shit. I don't think we're carrying $13,000 worth of shit. And the thing is, what kind of... Oh, that's five mil. Did I unload these? I better have. I do not want to sell any four... Uh, oh, wait. No, the ammo that I really need lots of is this 44 Magnum uh, hollow points. Uh, I forget the stats on this gun. I guess I'll check it out real quick. I forget if it's a rifle or what. That's not the inventory screen. Oh, he uses 4.7 millimeter. And it doesn't do very much damage, but it has good range and a huge clip. Um, I think that it sucks. I think it's not very good. Actually, this is not as good as a Pancor. Uh, we're not going to use that. Yeah, we got... Oh, we have 4.7. Well, maybe I'll leave it there just in case something bad happens that we need... Um, what the fuck do we need this for? I don't think that's worth very much, though. Uh, <laughs> we might get hurt. I have a hundred stim packs. We might get hurt. Oh my god! I think we can sell that. I guess I was collecting that. I think I remember we killed some people to get some booze. I think that actually happened. I think mom asked us to do something and we went around killing people. Wait a minute, Marty wouldn't do that. Would he? Well, Sula can fuck right off. We can just stand over here, please. Yeah, I know. Oh, um. You don't know what I think, dude. I'm not some asshole who tells you what I think if it's like negative and shit. Like, you don't need to hear that, even if I do think that. Also, um, it would be good if I could, like, access Sulek's inventory at the same time as I'm accessing mine. Yep, he's got the guns. Can't do that, but let's see if I can uh, trade enough shit to get that. Wow, they're not even worth anything. Okay, well, I certainly don't need them. It has ammo in it, but I don't need the ammo either. These are useless. Okay, yeah, we definitely have enough stuff to get one. 
And so, yeah, it has come to my attention. We probably have enough money. Also, let's just get as much as we can. Uh, I don't think we really need all this money. I can trade these away because since I'm carrying all the ones I need, I don't need those. Oh, we're trading too much. We're trading too much. Those guns are worth a ton. Look at that. Oh, man. 3500 each. Okay. Well, uh, I would like to not uh, lose value. Yeah, he's got that gun equipped, and then my revolver is in my inventory. I don't like having my guns in my inventory because then I might be tempted to just sell them by accident. Um. <laughs> That's not worth thirteen hundred bucks. Yeah. Okay, look. Uh, there's robots, but. How much are these worth? That's a rare fucking grenade, dude. What about these? General all-purpose awesome. Um. Okay. Well, I don't really need all that. Um. Fifteen thousand one hundred fifty minus sixteen. Oh wait, sixteen thousand three hundred forty-three minus fifteen thousand one hundred fifty. Uh. I think there's like a difference of like 1,200 something. Oh, that's pretty close. That was a good estimate. And seven. See, that was like quick and stuff. Um, all right. No, it, you answered all every question I needed. Okay, we got this gun. This gun is really awesome. Praise for its range and stopping power. The PPK-12 Gauss pistol is of German design. The pistol uses an electromagnetic electromagnetic field to propel rounds at tremendous speed and punch through almost any armor. Minimum strength only four. It has 12 shots of 2mm EC, which is not as uncommon as it probably should be. It weighs six goddamn pounds. Takes only two AP to shoot. And it does a fuck ton of damage at an incredible range. We are fucking strong. Sulik is still overloaded. Oh yeah, this guy still has money. Hey Sulik. Um What do you have that's overloading you? Is this is uh the combat armor mark two? It's great armor. Okay, we're not going to steal from that guy. Yep. Well, not so much a gun. Actually, well, I still want a gun, but I know you ain't got it. Unless uh, you received a shipment that I didn't see. Okay, let's just see what these are worth. That's worth way too much money. Does he have anything else with that we want? We haven't seen any needlers. Oh, hey! My favorite ammo in the world. Uh, well, we can always use more of this. That's worth a ton. Okay, so how about both of those? Okay, and you've got change, don't you? Almost. Hey, look, it goes above 9,999. Not 9,999. Um... I don't think we're ever going to use those FMJ bullets. <laughs> what are those? Nine? What even shoots that? The grease gun? I thought it was a 45. Uh, whatever. Close enough. Bye. Well, while we're here, uh, we've got the vertebrate plans. And somebody asked for the vertebrate plans. So we already gave it to the Brotherhood, and that's why they were so happy to see us. I probably should put my gun away. 
I love that gun. I love this gun. Oh, I love this gun. It's so good. So I didn't break into the computer. Yep. But these guys are probably going to like me a lot. Okay, dude. Remember, you must take the plans. Oh, okay. <laughs> but you look like the guy who's important. Why do I have to go to the side room? Is that him? Uh, was it this guy? I forget. Oh, that's no one. That's like the break room. No, it's like, well, yeah, it's a break room. Slash exercise room. Hey, guy. You have certain schematics to give to me. Yes. Ken Lee told me to give these to you. Speak to Ken Lee. He shall discuss what happens in your future. Thank you. We shall be able to verify some of our test data with these. Good day. Um, no, thanks. I <laughs> I'm like, uh, am I missing information? No, I'm not. I am not. Now I need to see uh, Ken Lee. Mr. Lee. Thank you for the vertebrate plans, Traveler. What can I do for you? Can I see the Emperor now? Well, you must complete a second test. The Hubologists are our enemies. Their leader, AHS-9, has been abducting and brainwashing our children. Kill him for the good of the sheep, and I shall tell you how to speak to the Emperor. He's a dead man walking. I am anxious to see the result of your attempt. Good day. Good day. Uh, Marty is kind of a nice guy, so, uh, assuming, like, he, um, would stay in character, and he probably wouldn't be like, oh, well, I'm a hitman for hire, and I have, I don't care, I'll kill you when you tell me to. Uh, what the fuck? Really? What's wrong with it? Uh, it's just, that's weird. <laughs> he would probably be like, uh, oh no, uh, I'm a nice guy, I like helping people, but, um, but, um, oh, but since there were only two options in that dialogue tree, <laughs> yeah, just run through people's houses, then, uh, somehow he would have been cajoled to saying, yes, okay, then I will do it. Anyway, these are the homologists. And uh, if you haven't gotten a Zeta scan yet, to improve your luck, you can, oh, you have to click that. You can do that. Now there's some things I think can go wrong here. Um, so, I'm trying to record my voice, not like lip smacking sounds, but it seems kind of. Uh, my presence is welcome over there. Oh, I need to talk to that guy. You state your business. I'm interested in potentially joining your group. Excellent. Go on in. Speak to Juan Cruz and Vicky Goldman. They're celebrities, you know, but they'll talk to you. Ooh, celebrities. You can find them in the prayer room, showing all of our new recruits and the raw meat just how rewarding it is to be a homologist. Well, let me add him. Doot. Okay. There's Vicky. There's Juan. Uh... That's AHS-9. So, I think... Probably just... Kinda... There's a guard there. Okay, I have a line of sight. Did a lot of damage. He's on the ground. I missed. I missed again. 
What the fuck? He's still alive. Oh man. All right. I'm gonna try to get out of the way. So hopefully my henchman can take care of him. Although, in retrospect, it may have made more sense to loot this place first. Oh, your human weapons cannot harm me. Don't you know who I am? <laughs> Vic is using a spear. Okay, well... I don't want Vic to die. Objective. Okay, we got him. We gained five karma. Okay, we're gonna have to kill a few guards. At least. Why do I keep missing? Is someone jinxed around here? The fucking dog here? Holy shit. Uh, please, feel free to join the battle. So it looks like the guards are coming. I don't know if Juan Cruz and Vicky Goldman are coming. Alien, uh... Alien movement. I don't know. It takes a long time. Um, I'm gonna kill you, because I can kill you. gun is so good. I don't have ammo? Oh god. I didn't bring the rest of the ammo with me. That's terrible. <laughs> That's okay. I don't need it. I mean, it's a great gun. But we already had good guns. Cassidy, what the fuck are you even doing? Oh, they ran back here. Yeah, okay, it's not my turn, is it? It's my turn, okay. I'm gonna take my gun. And since I'm here, I'm gonna take two guns. <laughs> and I swear you can load them from this screen. Actually, wait. I have that gun. Uh, these are both loaded. Okay. You're not an enemy, are you? You're an enemy. You are. Okay. I can shoot this gun three times. Yeah, so I have a 15% chance to get a critical hit. And then when I do get a crit... I have another 15% chance to roll above 100, which results in an instant kill. Wait, what the fuck is happening? I was hit for no damage at all. Vic is <laughs> using his spear. I don't know why. Just die. Fucking combat armor. Who is a bad guy? That's Sulik. That is not Sulik. Oh shit. It's not Cassidy either. And he's got the same gun. Which means Sulik might be in trouble. Uh, I can't shoot it from here. I don't know why I can't shoot it from here. Shit. So you're like, run, dude. He's gonna burst on us. Yeah, you got crit, Sulik. That's a bad dude. <sighs> Alright. Fuck <laughs> messing with my boys. Oh. I'm trying to box him in. 
What is he doing? I think he's running away in pain. That's not good. You know, I really don't know how healthy they were going into this. I think Cassidy may have still been hurt from back when he was, or uh, Vic might still be hurt from back when he was like, boss, it hurts, boss. <laughs> Even Cassidy has power armor. Okay. So. So look, don't run that way. If you're hurt. Okay, Cassidy is on the ground. Uh-oh. I need to go say Cassidy. Cassidy, you're wearing power armor. You're not supposed to be that easy to fuck with. Okay, we have to go this way then. Even though it's going to take all my AP. <coughs> I wish I could instruct Vic to just stay down here. Cassidy, don't die, bro. If Cassidy dies, we're going to have to go rest before we come here. <laughs> I totally forgot about that. That wasn't a good move. Fortunately, they're so stupid they're trying to use hand-to-hand -hand on a guy in power armor. Not very effective. I need a little more range. Okay, you shits. Who's got the gun? She's got a gun. That's just somebody. That's just somebody. Cultists. Yeah, they don't have weapons. Okay, but I want to shoot her. And I have a 74% chance to do so. I want the maximum number of shots so I can move one more. Okay. You bitch. Shoot someone else. I don't think that's going to be very effective. Oh no, you got crippled! For no damage. He's getting gang uh, affected. <laughs> One, two. Hey, you. With the gun. Don't do things. I didn't reload. Uh, if I do that, I'm not going to reload either. Hurt. I think Sulek is hurt. That fucking sucks. Fortunately, this base is huge, so we can run for quite a ways. Sulik has a ripper, but I don't know if he can use it. It's a knife. It seems like, well, Sulik looks uh, unique. He doesn't look like just anyone. So maybe he doesn't have the animation to use a knife. He can certainly use a spear. Uh, so can Vic, and Cassidy, and me. But spears aren't that great. There's no vibro blade spear. Um, um, I can't hit you for some reason. He will die if I don't do something. Why can't I? Oh, I didn't reload. <laughs> ah, good. <clears throat> I don't know if uh, Juan is actually dangerous. I don't think so. So that means I need to uh, go this way and try to help Sulek. <laughs> Sulik was tragically, critically hit for 24 hit points. And if he was already running away, then he's probably in a bad way. I wish he would keep running. 
Wow, Cassidy actually got hurt by the punching. Um, I had to get there. Dude, open the fucking door. And you're in the way, too. Yeah, where do you think? This way. Sulik, run, dude. Why are you standing there? <laughs> He's taking t two hit points of damage over and over again. Is he? Oh, good. He got up. That's good. He'll do some damage pretty soon. This guy doesn't have a gun. Well armed. Oh yeah, they are armed. Okay. Well. You gotta die. They just have so much hit points. So I have to use a gun that can really run them asunder. I mean, if I can get crits, my revolver is great. Problem is, I don't always get crits. Okay, well, I got to reload one or the other. I guess we'll switch. Dude, run! No, not that direction. Ugh. It doesn't hurt. Cassidy, do you have ammo, dude? Is the crippling really affecting you that much? What kind of shitty luck was it that you got crippled in the right arm? Okay, let's reload. For one AP. Holy shit. Die already. So, like... Holy fuck. He's getting the shit kicked out of him. I think I need to ignore this guard and just go to Sulik. Oh, I was hoping she'd open the door and I could just run out. Cassidy does not appear to be defending himself. Okay. Somebody's crippled and I'm crippled. I crippled my right leg, meaning that I can't run away real quick. In fact, I can barely move at all. I'm never going to get there in time. Oh. I can't. I can't heal that in combat. <sighs> Fuck. Wait, who looks dead? He looks dead. He's not dead. Maybe he ran out of ammo? Okay, he's got a gun. He's dead. He's a good dead. He's about to die. Yep, we didn't do this well enough. This never happened. Sulik was killed. Why isn't Cassidy attacking? Also, I don't think their combat settings are set up right. Because why aren't they attacking? I don't get it. Anyway, um, I could finish this fight, but... You know, it doesn't really matter. And even if I did, it would, you know, it's turn based combat. It's slow. It's boring. So, anyway, you could just assume, you know, I have 100 stim packs and a ton of ammo. Uh, I would kill everyone here that is hostile to me. And uh, Cassidy may or may not survive. But, um, 
Yeah, that's what would happen. But no one's going to see it because we're not doing that. Anyway, we need to leave. <clears throat> Got a bad feeling about going into that place. <laughs> Let's check what their need? combat settings. You got a gun. Good. Okay. Just, uh, yeah. Th I think that was fucked because for some reason there was nowhere good to run to. And then, uh, oh yeah, I had him on snipe the enemy. Just do what you want, dude. I don't care. Attack whoever you feel like. I don't give a shit. I think by limiting their uh, possible options, instead of focusing them on things, it just kind of filtered it out so they would do nothing instead. <laughs> That's it, buddy. All right. Uh, next warrior. He's got the assault rifle. That's an okay gun. Not great, but okay. I don't know if you have to. Distance. Okay, yeah. Whatever. That's why he's sticking to my ass so much. Just attack wh whoever you feel like. Now, that used to be important that they would guard me because I was a weakling. But not so much anymore. I should also check to make sure they have stim packs. Oh yeah, another thing that occurred to me. I had the bright idea of using buff out during the fight. I have Jet and Psycho too. What's up? You got that I need to tell you something you might not like look again. Yeah, don't fucking do that. Well, I don't want you to die. Yep. Wherever you want. Whoever you want. Okay, let's check their stem packs. Nope. That's it, buddy. Alright. He has some stem packs. Here, dude. Have some more. <laughs> uh, you can carry like 10. That's fine. Alright, this guy. Vic. He already has 10. And healing powders. Sulik. He has a few. Here. Regulation 10. How are they doing? He's in perfect health. He's in perfect health. And he's in perfect health. Almost. Um, let's go get the ammo. I should get the ammo. Ugh. I can't believe we had ammo. Oh, yeah. Didn't this guy sell two millimeters? And we took a trade where we, like, didn't get anything? Yeah, I'm not real smart all the time. That sucks. Ugh. Okay. You know, I don't think these guys care if I run around with my gun out. I don't think they do. Um, well, yeah, you know, let's actually, uh, let's, let's do this instead. <laughs> let's not, <laughs> I didn't really want to do that yet anyway, but the guy asked me to, so I was like, okay. And I thought it would be like real easy and stuff, but it turns out it's like it hasn't been. I think we have to go in here. No, wait, is it there? He lives in the big house. Yep. Okay. 
Um, I'm gonna cut it right here. Everyone, I'm losing my voice in a strange way. Uh, I'll see you next time, everyone. Bye-bye.